All right, fam. So look, I just came across another crazy video for y'all today. Now, y'all know I love me some Jesus, okay? Now, like I said, I know everybody has their own different beliefs. You feel me? But I love me my Jesus, okay? And, and I'm pretty sure if you've been following my channel, you know that I love me some Jesus. I know people be in the comment section, blah, blah, blah. Jesus ain't real, Jesus ain't real. And we can go on and on again until, we, until I'm blue in the face. I will give you proof that this man has lived and he is real and he is God. Okay, but look, anyways, that's besides the point. I mentioned Jesus because we're going to be react to a video. What race is Jesus? Okay, we're going to see what people have to say and what they feel like. What race is Jesus? You know what I'm saying? Like, is he black? Is he white? Is he Hispanic? What, what race is Jesus? Me personally, I don't care what race he is because I just serve a God that is, you know, that is all loving. He loves all race. He died on the cross for every race, not just one race. So that's just me. But, uh, and it's not just me. It's actually in the Bible too. So you know what I'm saying? He died for everybody's sins. But, but without further ado, I don't want to go on to preaching, man. Let's go ahead and get into the video, bro. If Jesus came back today, what race do you think he would be? He got to come back as a nigga, bro. Did I say that? Black. Why do you think he'd be black? I just did. Black. It'd, be, it'd be black? Yeah. Is that, is that universal? That's the chocolate man, y'all. Do you guys have any idea why? I feel like they probably said it in the Bible. I don't know the words word for word, but that man's probably chocolate, especially because he's been in the sun all the time. He's yeah. probably chocolate. I think it'll be a drag queen. He gotta come back as like a real nigga. Like, like. Hold on, wait. Did this man just say, I think he will be a drag queen? Just make it make sense. Why why in the world would Jesus come back as a drag queen? If if the Bible is a if God himself says that a homosexuality is a detestable sin, you dressing up as a as a woman, as a man, okay, like what I mean, like you're a man and you're dressing up as a woman. It, why 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 would Jesus come back like that? Just just make it make sense. Just make it make sense. Please. That, that does not even make logical sense. Like one of the dudes that be right here, like he got to come back like, hey Slim, did you repent yesterday? <laughs> he got to come back as Harriet Tubman. To like look like Mary, Harriet Tubman too? Yep, he got had a rap and everything. Jesus got to come back in New Balances and a local clothing brand. Wheeling and dealing out here. Wheeling and dealing and some New Balances. <laughs> you know what's funny, bro? Um, It's funny because in the Bible, Certain people, they thought that the son of God was going to come back as their little imagination type of imagery that they have of the son of God. He's going to come back like this. and He's going to come back like this. Jesus came back opposite of what other people thought he was going to come back as. You know what I'm saying? He came opposite. The man walked everywhere. Roll almost a donkey everywhere. Like he, he came back the opposite. People thought he was going to come back luxurious and all this and this and that and no, that man came back the opposite of what people wanted him to come back as or what people envisioned him to come back as. That's why people need to get in their word, truthfully. People truly need to get in their word. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you guys read everything else, but you don't want to read the Bible. You could go on and on and say who wrote the Bible, and I could tell you who wrote the Bible. But I could also tell you, okay, if you want to go on and on about the Bible, who wrote the history book? If you want to go on and on about the Bible, who, who wrote, uh, who even knows for a fact that our president's uh, from not the presidents now, but the presidents all the way back then where we wasn't even born yet. The very first president, like, that's what I'm saying. Like, how do I even know that was the very first president? How I know it wasn't another man? How I know it wasn't a black man named Jalen? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, we can go on and on and on. That's why people need to get in their word because y'all have this, this vision of, oh, Jesus need to come back as this. And he need to have new bounds on. He need to be like this. And he need to be like, hey, yo, bro, you repent. Like, come on, bro. Jesus is not coming back like that. You know what I'm saying? If you read the Bible and you understand his character and his love for us, trust and believe me, he's not coming back like that. Like, I'm just going to keep it a buck with y'all. I don't know what y'all be getting y'all little knowledge from, but, bro, some of y'all are not wise. You know what I'm saying? Y'all might be wise in other aspects, but y'all not wise. Y'all not wise when it comes to the Bible. Seriously, because Jesus is not coming back like that, bro. I joke too much, I would say he was Latino. I, I don't know what race he would be at all. We're just translucent person. Nah, Loki, hopefully Asian, bro. Hopefully Asian? Bring in some representation. <laughs> Boxer Rebellion part two, baby. I believe he'd be an equal of all of us. Would it be more like on the brown side, or like would he be like a, maybe a being of light? Be a color we've never seen before. DMT right there. Right. I don't know if you'd- See, that I can respect. That I can respect. Well, nobody knows the true color of Jesus, but I'm gonna let the video play. I'm not gonna continue to pause. Maybe a being of light. Maybe a color we've never seen before. DMT right there. 
Right. I don't know if he would come back as a human in human flesh. He might come back as an orb or energy. Or like like an animal, maybe like a rock yeah, or something. Right. I think we're like very one dimensional in thinking that he's gonna come back as human flesh. So do you think that he could already be here and he just might be just like a pebble or something? It could be God could be in all of us right now. God's inside me. I would definitely be in heaven. <laughs> so you think he would be black? Of course he's black. Because you can't live in Egypt and be light skinned. The the climate and the sand and all that, no. He's definitely black. He's or have some ethnic color. Or got some good tan. No, he's black. Probably brown. Is there any like any area that you think of particularly? I know it's believed like Middle Eastern, but I just assumed he wouldn't be white. God feeling, I think he's white actually. Really? Um, that's kind of how I've seen him and like portrayed in pictures and stuff. He'd definitely be Middle Eastern. When he's coming back, I believe that. I think he's gonna look like what he once did. Middle Eastern, like, you know. You know what's crazy? I didn't even think about this until now. The Holy Spirit just hit me. Bro, Jesus is not coming back in the human flesh. <laughs> he's not. He already came down in the human flesh. He did what he had to do, which was die for our sins. Now that our sins are forgiven, as long as we repent from our sins, the, the way that he sees he's going to come back is going to be in the sky, okay? Like, it's going to be it's going to be a moment where everybody's going to think it's probably some type of alien invasion, all type of crazy stuff that they might think. But in truth be told, Jesus is not going to be born again into a version. He's not going to come back again into the flesh. He's not going to do any of that, you know what I'm saying? So... And it made me think about the point that the ladies just made. Like, I had to think of I'm like, wait, hold on. Jesus is not coming back in human flesh. So, at the end of the day, we won't know what skin color he really is. Now, I don't understand why does it matter what skin color he really is. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just, I, I don't understand it. Because at the end of the day, I know me personally, I don't, I don't worship Jesus because of the skin color. He, I don't care if he was white. I don't care if he was Hispanic, Chinese. I don't care. Okay, I just know that this man went ahead, died on that cross. He died on that cross for my sins. My sins are forgiven now, and I live my life dedicated to him. I don't live a life outside of him. Outside of his will, I do not live a life. Do I sin every day? Yeah, I sin every day, but I'm forgiven for my sins. Am I dead into my sin? No. See, it's the difference between being dead in your sin and actually just you falling short here and there. Because the Bible says in Romans that all that all um, all believers fall short of the glory of God. So therefore, I know I'm gonna fall short of the glory of God. But uh, also in the book of uh, what book was that? Was it? Was it? Uh, no, it wasn't Proverbs. It wasn't Matthew. Dang, what book did? What book was that? I I low key forgot what book it was. But in the Bible, say that we are not to be controlled by our sin no more because we have been forgiven. We have been forgiven for our sin. So therefore, I just know that Jesus died on the cross for my sins. I know that He loves me. I know that He. Is here for everybody. He's not just dying for my race, but he's dying for a whole bunch of people races. So why do I care about what race he really is? You know what I'm saying? And when we get to heaven, we're not going to be no race. We're not going to be black, white, Spanish. I mean, like, we're not going to be no race. So why does it matter? <laughs> you know, darker, like, skin complexion, just, like, dark hair. Pretty Arab looking. Like yeah. Arab, African, North African. Oh, yes. sir, Jewish. Yeah. Also, the Jews are winning yeah. today. I mean, America. Jews don't come from where he was born because he was he's... born in like the Middle East so he's yeah. like uh, uh... Israel? Yeah, Israeli yeah. what is Jew? what nation is that? Uh, Israel? how when they're Israeli? do you believe in God sir? I know you're a God I know she a goddess and he a God okay mm -hmm. whatever he feel comfortable as in my opinion oh, whatever he wanted to be at that, on yeah. that day? whatever he wanted to be I guess it would be me, in a sense, because he's supposed to be in our likeness. Mm -hmm. So whatever I'm, color, the color I am, it would be the same. Oh, that's beautiful. Well, hey, thank you very much, ma'am. You're welcome. Give us a say. You people need to read your Bibles. <laughs> you people need to truly get into the Word of God. Okay, like, I understand that not a lot of people believe and God, but for you to sit there and say that we are gods, you know what I'm saying? When people say that, I just look at them like they're stupid. Like, I, I truly look at them like, because if I was a god, okay, first of all, a god is an infinite being. If I was a god, I wouldn't die. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't die if I was a god. <laughs> you feel me? But I die. You know what I'm saying? Like, we all die. We're all going to die at some point. You know what I'm saying? We're not all going to live. Nobody's going to live until 900 years old. You know what I'm saying? That was back then in the Old Testament in the Bible where they was living 900 years old and all type of years. But we're going to die eventually. So if I was a God, wouldn't I not die then? Like, I don't understand why people say those type of things. People just need to get into their word. 
Okay, truly get into the word. Seek after the Lord. The Bible tells us to seek the kingdom and his righteousness and all things will be added unto us. So y'all got to seek the kingdom, bro. Stop stop all this nonsense with Jesus is this color and Jesus is that color, bro. He's not coming back in the flesh. He's not going to come back riding down the street in a donkey. Like, he's not coming back that way. You know what I'm saying? He already done that. That, that's the, that was the reason why his first coming was to die for our sins. His second coming is going to be, yeah, not everybody going to go to heaven. <laughs> that's his second coming. Yeah, we all going to be looking confused. You know what I'm saying? When when, when some of when some of us don't get it, when some of us is not getting taken up and you just see the person next to you just, phew. And now, now it's like, oh, dang, okay. That's Jesus, come, that's Jesus' second coming. Jesus' first coming came in the flesh. The second coming is going to be the rapture. Okay, it's not going to be, we're all just going to be sitting on the street. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Like, no. Oh, man. So, y'all need to get in y'all word, man. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this video in the comment section below. Shout out to Man vs. Street. Main vs. Street, I believe that's their name. Uh, let me actually get it right. Man vs. Street. Man vs. Street. Uh, shout out to them, man. I truly love their videos and their content. Go subscribe to them. They have 31K right now. Try to get them to 40K. You feel me? But uh, yeah, I truly love their content, man. It's me, your boy, Depend. I love each and every one of y'all, bro. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace. <laughs>